All right. Well, in our ag report today, we're going to be talking about citrus trees. So Hi. let's talk about those. And Janine Ebling joins us. Good to see you. Thank you, ma'am, for Thank having you. me. I have been getting a few calls um, on, well, of course, you know, I always get a lot of calls. Oh, but, yeah. Uh, what I wanted to talk about was some of the calls I've got on citrus, some of the problems that people are having, some of the pests or like what are called leaf miners mm -hmm. and what we call web worms or tent worms. Mm -hmm. Um, mm. they're, mainly they uh, make the tree look kind of ugly, but most of the time the tree can deal with and it'll be fine. You know, I've mentioned this several times, if you have a healthy plant, it can pretty much deal with anything. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the problem with the tent, um, the uh, tent worms is that they put a web, okay, and it's hard to get to the worms. But if people will break those worms, uh, that tent open, birds love them. Okay. Okay, so that's oh, okay. a natural predator, okay. On the um, uh, uh, leaf miners, once the little larva gets into the leaf, there's not a whole lot you can do to it because it's protected by the out outside of the leaf, okay. Uh, there are natural predators for those, but those need to be introduced into the environment at an earlier stage. Okay. Another problem I've been getting people calling me and saying like their oranges aren't sweet or something like that. Yeah, they probably so haven't waited long enough to let them mature. Mm -hmm. Okay. So um, you're saying that the worms would not impact the actual Normally fruit on the tree. not. Normally not. I know if you have a really bad infestation, that could be a problem. But to be able to get to the worms, they've got to break open that, that tent. We call it a tent. Is that, you know, it's the actually a web. Kind of well, no, it's a web. Okay. It's a web, okay. Mm -hmm. And um, they can break that open. They can also use, like, just regular Dawn soap in a mixture, and that will eat through the tent, through the webbing. Mm -hmm. I keep saying tent because that's yeah. what we call them, but it's actually webbing. Uh, so there's several different things. I do have a website I wanted them to tell okay. about. Mm -hmm. This is our Aggie hyphen horticulture dot t-a-m-u dot e-d-u okay. there's a lot of information on that we also have an uh a website with our entomology website that they can go to and then our phone number is 835-8461 if they want to call me you know I always have lots of information i can send them all right well thank you so much again okay. all the citrus information you need to know and much more <laughs> all right and speaking of all the weather you need to know we're going to toss over to dana for a final check